The Peculiar Pig by Joy Stoyer Vald. There was a different sort of piglet in the pig pen one spring morning. But Mama Pig didn't care. She loved her piglet all the same. To her, each one was special. The other piglet were bigger and stronger and often pushed this little piglet away, aside. Sorry, but she was always willing to wait her turn. The day came when Mama Pig gave each piglet their name. She named them Fricus, Pinky, Prudent, Patch, Scrubby, Rolly, and my shiny little one, Penny. The piglet grew bigger every day and Penny grew longer. She sure is peculiar looking, Scrubby told Fricus. Penny didn't know why she was different, but Mama Pig told her, It doesn't matter, Penny. I love all my little piglets the same. As she grew, Penny started to sound different too. Ruff, woof, woof. Penny, you have a funny eye, Fricus says. And it's so loud, complained Patch. But Penny liked all the sounds she could make. She practiced her eyes, growls, and butts when Mama Pig while her sister and brothers played in the mud. All the piglet became good diggers. Ruthen worked Penny and told her, Proper pigs use their snorks to dig. But my purses work better, said Penny. Scrubby said, How particular! One day, the piglets were having fun racing around the farm. Wow, Penny sure is squeak, said Rolly. <laughs> Even with the short little legs, Pinky giggled. Then, something stopped them in their tracks. It was a scary hissing creature. <laughs> All of a sudden, a fearsome sound came from deep inside Penny. Grrr, Her sharp growls sent the creature slithering away. Wow, said the piglets. Thank you, Penny. Then they tried to bark just like Penny. Grrr, I. I Penny laughed and said, Now those are some cuteness. Grounds. Then they are agreed that pe peculiarities were perfect, and everyone was glad there was a different sort of piglet in the family. Thank you.